Hi guys, so today I want to share another story with you. Today I want to talk about Lita Margarita from 90 Day Fiance quitting. And just how devastated I am. This has to be the worst news I've heard in my entire life. I mean, right? Okay, let's go on. Now, allegedly in her post, she says, her and her fiance, Eric Rosenbrook, will not be returning to the TLC hit series. Now, she's talking about 90 Day Fiance, the spinoff, Happily Ever After. 90 Day Fiance has already wrapped filming. She's talking about the spinoff show. According to Lita, she wants off the show because she feels producers haven't been helpful in helping her deal with supposed death threats that she's been receiving. Now, according to Alita, people have been giving her death threats, as in people want her dead, okay? Now, I don't know who these people are. I mean, dead? Okay, all right, if you say so. I mean, I'm just wondering, who would be willing to go to prison for Lita? I mean, because that's where you go if you kill people. I mean, are these people hiring hitmen? What? What the hell is go? People want Lita dead? I mean, according to her. I mean, me personally, I don't know why anyone will want Lita dead, but maybe people want that box spring mattress on the floor. Maybe that's it. But let's go on to what she says. She said people have been bullying her on her social media. It got so bad that she had to report it to Instagram. Now, her account was closed for a couple of days, but it's now back up and running, okay? This is according to Lita. Now, according to the fans, they're being bullied by Lita. Supposedly, if you leave nasty comments on her Instagram account, she'll do mean things. She'll verbalize beat you up. <laughs> Did I just make up and say verbalize beat you up? She'll create memes on people. She doesn't like bad pub. And what's driving her crazy is she's getting a lot of bad pub these days because of her behavior on the show. She's mean to her future stepchildren. You know, the one she put out last week, Tasha. And who knows, she's probably mean to the little kid and we just don't know. I mean, no one's liking her behavior. And it looks like she can't take the heat, people. She can't take the heat. So what is she going to do? She's going to threaten, bully, throw a tantrum. That's what she does. Well, it works for Eric, but it's not going to work for the rest of the world. I mean, you can't just quit, walk off of a show. There's these things called contracts. Then it gets even more ridiculous if you're a naysayer. She called the cops and asked for a police presence, like Elvis used to do. So now Lita is the Elvis of 90 Day Fiance? Do you think weed is legal in Wisconsin? It's insane, people. The girl's insane. But here's the uh, backlash. People don't believe Lita even has death threats. <laughs> they think she's lying about it. Like, I mean... I believe someone will put a hit out on her, spend thousands of dollars, uh, willing to go to jail. I believe it. I mean, I don't really don't understand why people don't believe her. I know lots of people that have nothing better to do with their day besides think about Lita. Don't we all know a person like that? Duh. Fortunately for us people, the story doesn't stop there. There's more torture to go around. Now, of course, when Lita found out that the fans didn't believe her, she went back to her favorite place on earth, you know, Instagram. And this is what she said. She said, if I made those death threats by myself, I wouldn't let the authorities get involved. Whoever says boohoo Lita, this is on you. She says, I keep it real. I will never lie. Never? Okay. She says, I value honesty and I hope it will help me at court later no comment i mean i could say it's a cry for help but you know i don't want to do that because you know i'm being nice i'm just gonna go ahead and say what i think most people are thinking i think it's a well-proven fact that most mobsters are nicer than you i mean what kind of world do you live in when people think serial killer al capone is a sweetheart and you're not and they actually have real death threats. I mean, you've got to get it together, Lita. you got to get it together. And because I don't want their same reputation as you, I'm going to pretend like I care. I'm devastated. Lita quit. I mean, allegedly quit. Well, you're going to find out you really can't quit that easy. You know, I'm just saying. But, you know, I'm devastated and the rest of my day is ruined. Okay, you guys, let me know in the comments section, how do you feel about Lita quitting? Also, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and that notification button for more stories like these. Until next time, talk to you then. Bye.